Grammy's 2024 Live Updates, Taylor Swift makes history as first artist to win Album of the Year four times, Celine Dion surprises by presenting. The 66th Grammy Awards rocked Los Angeles's Crypto Arena on Sunday night. That I've been keeping from you for the last two years. And the Trevor Noah hosted ceremony was a night of hits and, dare we say, pretty much no misses. Between Tracy Chapman and Luke Combs' tearworthy duet of her fast car, to Billie Eilish's gorgeous rendition of her What Was I Made For? Which is that my brand new album comes out April 19th. It's called while perfectly recreating a 1965 Barbie outfit, to Miley Cyrus taking home her first ever Grammy, and then winning a second one, it truly was music's biggest night. Fantasia Barino did Tina Turner proud with, yup, a proud Mary tribute, where she held absolutely nothing back. I'm gonna go and post the cover right now backstage. Thank you, I love you, thank you. Billy Joel even took to the stage for his first Grammy performance this century, and then came back for an encore to end the night. And Joni Mitchell, 80, making her first Grammys performance, with Brandi Carlile, we're still emotional. Oh, and we can't leave out Jay-Z defending wife Beyonce's Grammys honor with a roast of the Recording Academy for her past snubs. But it was a record-busting album of the year win for Swift that made for the cherry on top of a sweet Grammy night. The gold she nabbed four midnights made her the only artist to win the top category four times. As if that wasn't enough of a moment, it was surprise presenter Celine Dion who handed her the gold. Travis Kelsey is loving Taylor Swift from afar. No distance can come between them. While Taylor Swift's boyfriend Travis Kelsey wasn't able to attend the Grammys this year, he made sure his support was known from miles away. The 34-year-old Kansas City Chiefs tight end liked a post by NPR on Instagram, featuring the singer-songwriter posing on the red carpet. Kelsey is currently in Las Vegas, focused on the Kansas City Chiefs' quest for back-to-back -back Super Bowl wins. After the ceremony ends tonight, Swift is scheduled to travel to Tokyo for the next leg of her era's tour. Super Bowl 58 kicks off on February 11th at Allegiant Stadium in Las Vegas. Taylor Swift sets Grammy record with most ever album of the year wins. And with that, Taylor Swift made history as the first artist ever to win album of the year four times. As if that wasn't enough of a moment, it was Celine Dion who handed her the gold, Four midnights. Could there be anything more iconic? I don't know man, um, you guys gotta come closer, she said, beckoning her squad that included friends and collaborators Jack Antonoff and Lana Del Rey, who was hiding back there, as Taylor pointed out. I think she's a legacy artist in her prime right now, I'm so lucky to be your friend, she said. For me, the award is the work. All I want to do is keep being able to do this, she said. Thank you for giving me the opportunity to do this. Taylor Swift wins the top prize for Album of the Year, making her the first artist ever to win four of the awards. Taylor Swift wins the top prize of the night, Album of the Year, becoming the first ever artist to win four of the top awards. All the latest news, showbiz,